Describe a hedging strategy. Hedging strategies are, are interesting in that they take many different forms. If you think of you want to be long the US dollar. In other words, you favor the US dollar as, a, as a, giving you a favorable outcome in your investment strategy. But you're uncertain of exactly how that strategy is going to pan out. So you might go long the US dollar, but short the euro. Now, why would you do that? All right. Effectively, your long position gives you the outcome that you're looking for, but because there's a relationship between the euro and the, the dollar, effectively, that relationship provides you with an element of hedging against a negative outcome of the thing that you like long, right? And you giving up a little bit of that potential gain by paying away the short position that you have in the euro, which gives you that protection. So essentially, it's a mitigation of uh, some of the uh, uh, risk, but it does have a cost attached to it. All hedging has a cost attached to it. The perfect hedge is something that goes, that you say is going to go up, married against something you say that's going to go down, and both those outcomes happen at the same time. So in other words, you gain on the thing that went up and you gain on the thing that went down. That would be the perfect strategy. Very difficult to achieve, and uh, not many people have any kind of track record to prove that.